A statement of purpose from your anonymous friends. Anonymous is currently targeting Sony's website. We are doing this because Sony is currently suing people for making features that PlayStation originally had available to the public. We refer to the ability to install Linux. Despite the fact that this was an advertised feature, Sony got access to the PS3's firmware under the guise of security concerns. In truth, this does nothing but restricting access to legally purchased material, the PS3 system itself. People who refused to update their consoles lost features such as PSN access, and to related media content and to playback of some PS3 software titles or Blu-ray discs. As Techland reported, George Hutz, a PS3 hacker, figured out how to jailbreak the PS3, or unlock the features Sony removed with the 3.21 patch. Hots, using the online persona Geo Hots, released the instructions for the jailbreak on his personal site, and Sony brought legal action against him. Additionally, Sony has received permission to subpoena Bluehost, Geo Hots' hosting company, to reveal a list of IP addresses of every visitor that visited Geo Hots' site. This means that everybody who ever visited Geo Hots' website or watched his YouTube video documenting the jailbreak is at risk of having their IP handed over to Sony. This is why anons all over the world are currently attacking Sony, and not the PSN login servers, which we have access to but are refraining from attacking. We are not after the players. Our demands are these. Sony must allow for end user modification of the PS3 as was available prior to the 3.21 update. Sony must end any attempts to bring legal action to those wishing to alter a product they own. Sony must not pursue legal action against the collected IP addresses. We are not being unreasonable in our demands. We ask only that Sony restore the features that were originally found on the PlayStation 3. We are anonymous. We are legion. We do not forgive. We do not forget. You should have expected us.